walkthrough, playthrough, review, anything like that. It's just me playing the game badly so you can see what it looks like. Okay, time for something a little bit different. As you might know, I'm not big on the iPhone as a games system, but this is just so great I want to show it to you. Final Freeway. This is where I struggle. Um, I'm not big on the whole um, touch screen as a control system thing. And it's definitely hard when you're playing through a camera viewfinder. But we're going to give it a go because the game is great. Tilt to steer. Right thumb to accelerate. Left thumb to brake. We're not bothering too much with the brakes here. We'll be hitting the backs of the cars to slow down. The tilt works reasonably well. What makes this game great, you've probably figured out already. It is a shameless rip-off of OutRun. And it does it really well. I mean, it's got the sprite scaling down perfectly. Um, the car's a Ferrari, more or less. Probably completely unlicensed, but I don't care. But if that's not an F50, I don't know what is. Keeping the screen in the world viewfinder is not easy. Playing the game looking at the viewfinder is even harder, but... Oops. What is that? That looked look like a Fiat 500. Would have been even cooler had it been a Morris Minor. They need to make a Morris Minor racing game. That would be great. You know, you get Volkswagen Beetle games, you get Minis that appear to be a Fiat 500. We want Morris Minor racing. Morris Minor Turbo Challenge. Hmm. Oh. Yeah, as you can see, I didn't do very well. That's to be expected. It isn't too hard. Um, well, it's, I don't know if it isn't too hard. It isn't too hard to certainly get through more levels than I just did. Um... but playing it through a viewfinder is really tricky. I do like, I mean, there are lots of options on this. You don't have to use the tilt control. You can have swipe control. I haven't actually tried that yet. Um, this is working for me to a degree. It's not, it doesn't give you ultra fine control, but it seems to work. definitely having more trouble with the, whoops, with the accelerator than I am with the steering but as I say that is, is that's more to do with how I'm sitting here and trying to play it while recording I don't have this problem when I'm not recording come on get out of the bloody I was going to say out of the bushes but I wasn't in the bushes No time to stop and pee at the side of the road. Come on. There he was, peeing in a bush. Yay! This is prettier. Oops. Come on. Come on. Come on. Move. It's funny, I, I mean, there are some really advanced racing games on here, and I haven't tried any of them. They tend to be like whopping great big files, hundreds of megabytes, and I, I've only got the 8 gig iPhone, and I just, I don't want to fill it with games. Um, this, 12 megs, and it's great. And it, the price, is excellent. I mean, that there's a free demo of it, which only gives you two levels, so I, I, <laughs> I probably could have just got by with that, thing as I'm probably not going to get past two levels. But yeah, the, the full game is 59 pence, so um, I think it's very good value for money, because it's an excellent OutRun clone. Oh. 
there you go, perfect demonstration of me playing badly. Um, I do slightly better than that when not playing through a camera viewfinder, but not much. But it is, it's, it's great. It's worth every penny, all 59 pennies. Final freeway, uh, I don't know who it's made by, does it say there? Game Center. Don't, no, that's not them, is <laughs> it? That's, that's an iPhone thing. Um, it's great. Really like it. Okay. Thank you for watching. <laughs>